yesterday I went online and for some reasons I asked myself how dirty is our society I, I have an app Jumia on my phone so I went to check some bad products online that people use to replace a sex partner I said let me see how corrupt our society is because this is Africa I said let me read reviews I checked about two three products and I was reading I was weeping I said people are lost many of these people are Christians who we tell them the truth many of them are going to church Nobody tells them the truth. If you tell them the truth, they attack you. Because the one who does miracles, whether staged or demonically inspired, or through the grace of God that makes such miracles to happen suddenly, those people don't tell them the truth. A lot of times they are after the money. It was actually someone who emailed me through biblical sexual purity. And the person says, I want you to do a teaching on husband and wife using gadgets, some of these products in their bedroom that some Christian websites actually permit this. So this is one of the things that informed me going online to go and check, okay, how do people actually patronize these products over here? So I went to a local market a national market over here online to search for it and i went i was so sad and i i got up and telling myself we are not doing enough our children are getting lost our youths are getting lost these are things that our parents never knew that they enjoyed their marriages they enjoyed their lives today we have a lot of addicts even in church but what do we do I prophesy to you, I prophesy to you, no trouble will come to you. And some of these people coming to church, coming with their loads of sins. They are coming with their bags of addictions. But the most of the watchmen, most of the shepherds have been carried away. A lot of them are concerned about the immediate gratification, the immediate financial gains. That is what they are concerned about. God is calling us to action. God is calling us to wake up from our slumber. 